Hi, I'm making this video to show you how to uh, add tables to your documents in Google Drive. So right here I have just a normal document and there's nothing on it. <clears throat> and let me just put the date to show you how this document is just a normal document. And now you can write um, anything you want here. And let's say you want to put in a table. Now, a table is not a table like your kitchen table or your coffee table. This is a bunch of rows and columns together. And there's two ways to put a table into your document. One, you can go to Insert, Table, and decide how many rows and columns you want. The other way to do this is to go to Table insert table and again you can choose how many columns and rows you want so I'm going to make just a quick three by two table and once you create it there it is it's that simple okay so now maybe you can use this to organize some information so for example we did an activity the other day in our class about creativity so I can title this table Creativity. I'm going to center that and make it a little bit bigger. And we talked about what does creativity look like, feel like, and sound like. And let's say you have your paper or you want to add your ideas to a document like this. You would just type what you think in here and you'll see as you hit return, the uh, table adjusts to how much you're typing or whatever you put inside. Okay, um, just another quick idea about how you might use a table. Uh, let's say we're doing spelling for uh, words their way in your word study. So let's say, um, you want to just for your own record or to help you practice you want to put in a table of uh, your words so you can also just right click I think uh, not yet okay so you go up to I'll go to insert uh, table and this week we had four different sorts so I'm gonna go uh, let's say I'll go four by five okay and <clears throat> now you can put in your spelling words to help you practice and to add new words okay so we had um, this was one sort and we also had vowel vowel consonant then we had the e drop and the, what was the other one? Well, nothing changed. Okay, so this is our spelling uh, word study for this week. And you had an example like use and we look. This would be, oh, one other thing to move from uh, box to box. If you hit tab, it will take you from box to box, or you can just click in the box you want. But tab is a way to quickly move through your table like this. So this is an example of your word sort for this week. If you want to, you can highlight all of these, the top, and make that bold. And then let's say maybe you're finding some new words that fit in these categories. So uh, you can make the new words you find a different color. Like that. And just adjust it however you want. This basically is just another way for you to organize information and communicate uh, what you're learning using these tables. You can also add things, uh, add rows. Really, if you just click on the table anywhere, you can go to uh, table. You can add columns. You can add rows. You can delete rows. You can delete columns. You can take away the table altogether. So just for example, if I want to add a row, I could go to insert row below, 
there's a whole new row if I wanted a new column. And here's where I can right click and uh, add a whole new column. However you want to use your tables is up to you, but I think they're a good way for you to organize um, some of the things you're learning, some of the things you're writing about. So <clears throat> those are tables, and I hope to see some of you try this out sometime soon. Thank you.